in Sri Rangpatna and uh, there is a river here. So we thought of just visiting here. Uh, I see my daughter. Can you see? She is enjoying the river. Uh, don't worry, she, there is a stone and uh, she is sitting on stone and she is just playing. And it is very nice. Time pass here. Like we can uh, enjoy if you have some time here. It's a beautiful place. <laughs> See, many people came here. Isn't it beautiful? People will be asking like uh, whenever you travel, what do you eat? What do you carry? And it's very simple answer. There are many things to carry. Nature has given us the many things we can carry that. What I brought here is a watermelon <laughs> yeah i have cut this uh, and i brought that and grapes see grapes are very convenient uh, we can carry wherever we go because uh, it's a uh, handy and you can eat it like that itself right uh, so my daughter already had watermelon morning itself so she wants grapes so she choose grapes so I have chosen uh, watermelon. So I am enjoying watermelon. <laughs> See. <laughs> See wherever we go. Like why we think about the other options. Like uh, uh, food to carry. Cooked food. Or any snacks. Biscuits. Uh, chips. Other things. Why we have to think like that. We can carry. Mother nature has given you ready food. Right. For traveling. It's the best option to carry fruits and that too grapes and oranges and bananas are very convenient to carry. See even I have brought the oranges but we will have this later. So oranges also very fresh fruit wherever you go right, like ready to eat right and even, even your mouth will also feel fresh and you will also feel fresh. And we have visited some other places in Sri Rangpatna. This is a jail, Colonel Bailia's um, jail. Here what they do is like they will tie the prisoners uh, and uh, make them die by filling this full area with water. Can you see this uh, jail is little bit drowned from the ground level so that um, they will fill this full of water. Yeah and uh, without uh, oxygen they will die now this method uh, they used to use and um, this is a little pretty horrible right <laughs> yeah <laughs> they used to make them die like this way and uh, we are just uh, <laughs> roaming here and seeing those places uh, it was see this is the stone it has a hole from our from the center and they used to tie there mm, right see this area they will fill with water and uh, okay and we have uh, visited some other places also and um, next is like um, there is a smarak and uh, in this smarak they have written uh, like uh, how many soldiers came from other country or something like that and they have written how many gone missed and how many injured like that uh, how many killed so yeah this is a, a nice place to visit and all over the like there is a like a wall uh, uh, throughout the Sri Rangpatna and they have the whole like they used to aim if someone is uh, coming inside they will uh, aim them and this is the Gumbas uh, this is also a nice place um, and we have visited so many other little small small places is there and this is Juma Masjid so yeah it was pretty awesome time pass uh, we enjoyed that day and it was uh, like uh, finished everything seeing and uh, then we had a coconut water coconut water is very refreshing wherever you go in india you will find it right and why we have to worry about the food what we have to eat in india you will get fruits and coconut vendors fruit vendors everywhere even in the roadside also see and do, please don't buy 
the uh, fruits which they have cut earlier so tell them to cut for you uh, that time itself so that is the best option see wherever you go there are many stalls will be there even in the roadside can you see that in the roadsides also they will be selling fruits and coconut vendors so this is a one day <laughs> trip for sri rangpatna it was uh, fun we enjoyed it there are even other places in sri rangpatna temples and all but we didn't uh, go there because we have earlier visited so many times so hope you all liked it so okay guys see you in the next video namaste